hey everyone welcome back again to my channel in today's tutorial i'm going to be walking you guys through on how i start this hairstyle or how you can start this hairstyle for your child that will make your baby girl look so beautiful and fabulous and i'm also going to show you guys this is how i prepare the hair i use for her ponytail and i if you want me to create um, a video from beginning to the end how i start this ponytail just let me know in the comment section and i will do just that so i'm also going to be telling you on how to maintain this hair not just to make it but how also to help your your baby girl to maintain this hair this hairstyle is okay for both adults and kids if you're ready to know how i made this hairstyle let's get to it guys <music> For a start, I'm going to start sectioning the hair from this side of her ears to the other side. Like I'm going to take it straight there. When I'm done, I will use, use rubber band to hold the hair, which is the back side. When I'm done with the sectioning, I'm going to use Shana Jam to clear the part. I will be dropping the name of the Shana Jam I'm using, like the hair gel I'm using, not Shana Jam in the in the description uh, section feel free to go check it out so after that i'll part the hair the front side i will section it into two parts also use a hair gel to clear the parts then i will use hair uh, band to hold one side while i start making the other side please always remember to use water and um, hair moisturizer for your for your hair or for your child's hair before you start making the hair so the moisturizer that i use the hair moisturizer that i use i'm going to also be dropping the name in the comment section these are the two uh, products hair moisturizer and water or rosemary water then a tango free spray so these are the three things i use on my daughter's hair i will be dropping the name in the description section just feel free to check it out so i use rubber band to, to hold the hair then what I did I didn't show it from this beginning anyway but you start seeing it now I twist the hair so um the reason why the reason why is so um I would recommend it to twist the hair is it keeps the hair uh, longer and remember when you want to tip your hair you need to be twisting your hair for example you wash you finish washing your hair after undoing your hair so the only way you can like protect your hair and also make your hair half tip is by keep twisting your hair so that is why most of the time we see i'm making my children say i like to do maybe the end of the hair uh, to twist it it gives the hair good tip so after holding it with rubber band then i'll just part the hair into two then i'll twist it drop it i will session another part had it down the, uh, to it so in case you are wondering after twisting this one now if you had it to the other hair how will you twist it just hold on i'm going to walk you through don't worry so that's what we are here for right <laughs> yes so i'm going to walk you through on how to do it it's very easy so um yeah you can use black rubber band see the way i did i did it now and for this hairstyle i recommend you use um colored rubber band to give the hair um a, a fine color you know kids most especially when you're making kids hair you should use a bright color for them so use colorful rubber band but if you, as an adult if you want to make something like that maybe you want to make ponytail you can use black you know black it will just look like nothing happened like you use your hair and all that it will not be it will not look childish i don't know how to explain it but when you are making this kind of hairstyle for your child, you use a colored uh, rubber band. But if you happen that you don't have it, you only have black color at home. Not to worry. If you have hair clip that is colorful, just after finish making the hair, make sure you put a colored um, hair clip on it. It will still stand as if you use rubber band. So in case you did follow it up um, from the other side. So this is how I made it. So after session it, use a uh, hair gel to kind of rub it a little 
then comb it. If the combing is not smooth, spray it with water and give it a good comb. Then use rubber band to hold the edge. So what you do as you're holding it, um, when you're done, take the hair, as you are taking it, twist it again and hold it with the rubber band again with, with the hair. Then add a little one from that one you've not made already. Add it to the one you twisted already and twist all of them together. It will come out so perfect. I hope you're getting the way I'm, I'm, I explain it. So just wash it again and see the way I do it. You see? So it's very easy. Don't worry. Don't feel like ah, I can't do it. I know you can do it. Okay? Remember, when I session the hair from the other side to the other side, so the front side is what I'm using rubber band for now. Then the back side, I use hair um, clip to just hair packer to pack it. And I'm going to deal with that one later. So this is the last part we are going to make it at the front. It's the first time of coming across my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by to watch my video. And please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and turn on the, the notification bell so you get notified whenever we drop a new video. Titan subscriber, thank you so much. We appreciate you all. So please also help us to share the video. Thank you so much. So you see, what I is um, um I want to just explain uh, very quick before we, we round up is when you are making kids hair, please try avoid holding the front too much at the end of the day when you are done doing it you can use your brush to just brush the hair in, in it so um, rub, uh, apply the gel at the edge of the hair so you know we're not going to hold it so we're just going to use hair brush to brush it after doing that i use hair brush to just brush it to the hair that's all then i will pick I'll turn the hair and pick the ones I've twisted, you know, and add everything to it. Then use um hair band to hold it. So you see the way I pick it uh, uh, bit by bit to make sure everything enter carefully before I use hair band to hold it. So after doing that, I twist um like I I weave the hair. Then after that, I use another hair band to hold it again before I put the ponytail. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I really would appreciate if you can just um, give the video a thumbs up and tell me what you think about this hair. Give me your um, your thoughts about this hair and I'll be really glad to read from you guys. So you hold it until it's tight enough but not from the down so she don't um, start flipping. After that, you see, this is the hair I made myself. Then when you are putting it, you have to start from the front, stay at the front, keep doing it, just keep um rolling it until uh, you are not able, you are unable to, to roll it in anymore. This way, even if she sleeps with it, she play with it, the hair will not fall off. So just keep doing it until um it's tight enough, like you know that it's really okay before you stop it. Then pack the hair back, you see? We are done. So, my lovely people, I hope you liked this video. I hope this video suits your taste. I hope you will try this hairstyle, this amazing hairstyle. And, yeah, and I hope your child, and I believe your child will like it because it's easy. It doesn't, it don't make them sit for too long. You see what I mean? So, just try this hairstyle on them and let me know um how they feel about the hairstyle and i hope to see you guys in my next video until then stay safe bye for now